previous part we studied about alcohols now we'll go for phenols now what are phenols phenols are also compounds which contain oh group alcohols are also containing oh phenols also contain oh group but in phenols the oh group is directly attached to the aromatic ring this is aromatic ring we have taken example aromatic ring benzene ring containing oh group this is a phenol phenolic compound and this is again two benzene rings which directly carries oh group this again a phenolic compound both of them are phenolic compound and particularly this compound is called as phenol itself both are phenolic in nature but this compound is phenol itself this is also having phenolic nature now how is the classification done classification is on the basis of number of oh groups present just like alcohols we classify phenol as monohydric phenols the phenols that contain only one oh group directly attached to benzene ring monohydric phenols dihydric mother there are two oh groups attached direct loop to the benzene nucleus to the aromatic ring trihydric phenol mother there are three oh groups attached to phenol and polyhydric mother there are more than three oh groups which are attached to the aromatic ring these are phenolic compounds now next part is ethers what are ethers ethers are compounds in which oxygen atom is directly attached to two alkyl groups or it is attached to one alkyl one aryl group that is aromatic ar indicates aromatic so aromatic ring or oxygen is directly attached to two aromatic rings so what is what are ethers basically this is not given but you must know that ethers are derived from water h o h h o h what is done both the hydrogens are replaced either by r alkyl groups which may be same or different or it is replaced sometimes by ar aromatic ring ithe h la replace kala kara aromatic ring you can put an aromatic ring here benzene nucleus zala ether form zala it is r and it is aromatic ring or it can be both the ar rings aromatic nucleus present on both the sides of oxygen this forms the definition of ether that oxygen is directly bonded to two same or different alkyl groups or aryl groups now how do we classify ethers classification of ether is done in two types first we call the ether as ethers are classified as symmetrical or simple ethers what are simple and symmetrical ethers simple or symmetrical the meaning is oxygen atom carries two groups which are same those are said to be simple or symmetrical the word symmetrical indicates what same the two r groups are same you call it as a simple ether or you can have r you can have r dash o r dash no e r dash r dash same you can have aromatic ring o a r both the aromatic rings are same such ethers are said to be simple or symmetrical ethers and what is unsymmetrical ether then or mixed ether when the two r groups which are attached to oxygen are different so you can have example we can write this as o r dash and other is r example can be you can have ch3 o c2h5 this is an example of a mixed ether or you can have r and other group as ar again this is example of a mixed type of ether so this makes an easy part for phenols and ethers